Violent clashes at Istanbul's Taksim Square as protesters and police face off. Two weeks ago, it started out as a small demo by secularists and conservationists over plans to redevelop Gezi Park, mushroomed into a countrywide protest. Thousands have been injured in the violence. Global condemnation of police brutality and disregard of basic human rights also saw protests outside parliament. On Tuesday, the Green Party invited representatives from the Turkish movement to Strasbourg. I think it's very important that we get people from Turkey to talk to us here, to talk about what's happening in Istanbul and also other cities of Turkey. And I think it's absolutely vital that the European Parliament strongly condemns the police violence, the tear gassing of protesters, of people who are just standing up for a couple of trees for their right to take part in decision making and to strongly say this is not worthy of an EU candidate country. Telling tales of violence and solidarity, Mehmet Ali Albora, who has been involved since the beginning, joined the debate via Skype. After the usage of violence against pe peaceful people, the matter also became to protest the violence against freedom of expression. People then started to express themselves on matters that they think they couldn't had the chance to express before. At the plenary, MEPs debated the situation in Turkey with Catherine Ashton, the High Representative for the Union for Foreign Affairs and Security Policy, passing a resolution condemning the excessive use of force by police. Back in Turkey, in an effort to placate protesters, the AK party said it would consider a referendum on the redevelopment of Gezi Park. But will that be enough? If you stop the violence, it's not enough to say that they have changed the system. We have also to look into a case that whether the Erdogan government is in the long run going in the right direction in order to meet the values of the European Union or we have to develop ideas for a new type of relationship with uh, Turkey which is not a membership relationship.